pos it's possible to create a device uh, as we did with the head welder. The next step for most people will be to place various devices onto a factory floor, a layout. To do this, there are various tool branches and tools that are available within digital manufacturing tools like Dolia. In the case of Dolia, there are three main areas in which we can create digital layouts and processes to go with them. As we see on the left hand side here in the tree, where we can see the product, process and resources. And we will insert a product and we will insert resources in this and in later exercises. To begin with, I'm just going to show the basic process with a simple initial layout comprising a floor and two robots that will be placed on the floor. We start by selecting insert to insert some artifact, in this case a resource, which is going to be the floor layout or plant floor. This is a simple piece of planar geometry but it has the property that it will allow objects to snap down onto it under gravity. There we go, just a simple laminar sheet onto which we will insert items from a catalogue. Most robots are available within a catalogue, we do not need to draw them ourselves. So we can just simply go through here, these are, these are ABB robots, one of the main robot manufacturers in the world, and we'll choose our robot in IRB 6400 a certain size and place it with two simple clicks in an approximate position. We can now move these around by snapping the compass onto them, which allows us to rotate them and move them in three dimensions. So we'll just select them, you can see that they get selected, although the orange on orange colour doesn't help too much. We'll snap the compass onto one of these, you see the compass positioned here. We can then drag the compass around and in so doing we drag, drag the robot around. I'm just going to the editing screen here and I'm going to rotate this robot through 90 degrees so it faces towards the other robot. Going to minus 90 here and then apply it. And if we just move that away, you'll see there's our robot rotated 390 degrees. And that's our simple layout to begin with.